Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Novanaga here, and we are back with some more Persona 5 Strikers for you guys. I know it's been once again two months. I swear this is not on purpose. I'm just dealing with a whole lot of personal stuff to sum it up, make a long story short, not to um, <clears throat> spill my personal business out there. You know, for those that know, they know they know what I've been going through these past month or so, and. And I just kind of want to, like, um, eventually get past that and, uh, move on with my life. And get back to doing what I was doing before, before all this stuff started to happen to me. And one of those things is playing Persona 5 Striker. Because I have yet to beat this game, and it is nearly August. And with Atlas announcing seven new projects for Persona, literally, uh, in the next couple of months, I need to beat this game quick, fast, and in a hurry, okay? Now, no, this episode's not gonna be freaking five hours or so, alright? But I probably will do cuts and transitions here and there so the video doesn't feel as long, okay? But let me tell you things that I've done lately. Um, I've recently gotten back on Twitch, and I have hit affiliate, which I thought was pretty freaking cool. Um, I recently made a TikTok, and all the stuff to my socials is in the link, is, is in, are, are in the description box down below if you guys want to check it out and stuff. Want, want to support the boy there? I really appreciate it, and I also want to say thank you guys so much for. 40 subs on YouTube because I know I've uploaded in two months and usually and and the reason why I hit 40 subs is because I was on Twitch and I and I was plugging on my socials and stuff and I decided to check YouTube just because and I see that I hit 40 subs and I was, I was happy as heck like I was like wow you know like people really really supporting the boy and and it made me smile and nearly made me cry seeing seeing the seeing, uh seeing the support you guys have been giving me this past um week or so and um i just want to get back in the, in, the, in the groove of things you know you know provide some good content for you guys like like don't worry man we're going to be doing some persona 5 strikers we're going to get back in dbfz eventually because i heard they got a new patch coming out next month that would be pretty cool to see what they do as far as balance patches go. Like I said, Persona News is going to be coming out in September. And I do have another video in mind that I plan on doing. It's probably not going to be done for like another, for I don't know, maybe like another month or so. But I have a video in mind that I want to do based off of Persona. And I hope you guys enjoy it. Speaking of enjoying stuff, if you enjoy this video and my glorious return to YouTube, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, click the notification bell, um, comment what you think of the video, and I don't know, oh, don't spoil this game for me because I did not look up anything about this game, literally the last thing I did was a couple of months ago and it was off screen doing side quests, so do not spoil this game for me if you know what happens. Okay, I'm only at the third jail right here. So let's just hop in real quick. I know I got okay. some requests set let's up start the mission. from last time. And all of them are in Sapporo's jail. Okay. Already started off with a banger. Yes, sir. Is there a way I can do auto? Or is there I'm going the wrong way, Chief. This should prove useful. Huh? 
is rather striking. The closer we get, the more vivid its detail. Detail aside, we can't get in again. Then let's search for another entrance. Also, let me just say that that, that, that despite the opinion of some... And despite what I said earlier on this put through... I love what Atlas tried to do with this game. I don't know. I can understand the direction they were going for. But I can see why it didn't hit this song. I will say this though. The music fucking hit. Okay. That's all I will say. The music absolutely hit. You cannot tell me other one. Hi, Pixie! Satanta, come on! Black O's! You guys are Ravish them! Ravish them! Resist! I'm trying to hear that crap. Fire! Fire! Ooh, okay. I need no war in here. Come! Hey, let me get no war in here. Hm. No war? What are you doing? <laughs> I'm gonna get rid of that. I'm gonna get rid of Yosuke. Like, literally, Yosuke does not need to be here. Wait, I called him Yosuke? I meant Yusuke. It's been a while. Okay. It, it's been a while. Alright. Nice checkpoint. Pussy. Arsen! Ow, ow, ow. Let's go. Still a lot of enemies. Oh, what a dog. Hold that. Take this! Persona! Jack Frost! Mark Black Goon! Come on! Tata! Hi Pixie! Oh, I don't got a... Jack Frost! I don't have a Persona with Mark none? Mark Black Goons! Oh, this is... Rabbit! Almost there! Stay strong, everyone! Good job, everyone! Okay, let's keep going. Just give me that shit. Get back in here. I'll do it. Persona! 
I'm mad at the one that's in the I'm mad at the one that's in the That's my only gun, I guess. Oh, oh, there we go. I don't think he's dead. Is he dead? 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 He's dead. How are we gonna reach it though? Is there anything we can use like a platform? Oh, no. I like it there though. Focus. Eleven minutes later, twelve seconds. Once we get in the castle, we're headed straight for the roof. Are you ready? Am I ready? Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Sorry about that, but I, like I wanted to know what was over there in that chest, but that puzzle too difficult, man. All right, infiltration successful. What's that? All right. What do you mean? What's that? It's a damn chandelier. Are you Shadow dumb? spotted ahead. Be careful. What? It? Huh. Your chance. Sorry, I figure out what that was. Idiot. Let's go. All right. Come on, bro. Easy. I didn't even use my short time right there. Probably gonna be another battle. Yep. What is it gonna be? The rule of three. Wow. It's beautiful. Yes. Such a magnificent design. You wanna go? This is no time to be distracted by architecture. There are enemies here. That's it. Why don't you Ooh. Look at no shadows at the moment. Let's keep going. Hiro should be up ahead, but there's a problem. The door is frozen. All right, Skull, you're up. Heck no! I don't want my hands getting stuck. Guess that's not an option then. Let's find another way. Oh no. You do have on, by the way. Why, why can't she just? Oh, I don't know. That looks suspicious. Use her persona and burn shit the fuck down. <laughs> a treasure chest. Imagine we're going to open it. Hold on. It seems like it'll be useful. Oh, it was legit. Just do the judgment. What magical wonders lie within. Garden sense. Score! Now <laughs> let's get some more. Meanwhile, I could just went down and just pop. Shadows! Wipe them out! I'm gonna wipe them out. 
Too many skills. Well, I don't want to relearn a weaker skill. Makes sense out hey, of that. Hey, do you think we could reach the outside from that window? Ah, if we climb out through there, we may be able to ascend the outer wall. By now? I don't think they're here to mess around. Be ready for a challenge. Come. I'm always down for a challenge. Oh, Jesus. What's your weakness again, Kurt? Come on, black and black man. Jack from our set. Grab it, Jack. Leader of the fish team, Coriander. Persona. It's over. Die, bitch. It's your time. That did nothing. Get both of them. Showtime. Arsene. Arsene. Here. It's all about the hard knockdown. Come. Let's go. Grab it, Seth. I have a lot of SP items. This one. I have a good one to Sorry. Super strong. Be careful out there. Fire. 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 Not here! Ugh. It's more! Charge! Oh, they're both nearly dead. Yes. Holy shit, that did a lot of damage. Yep. Nailed it! And how did Joker die again? There! Wonderful, Mona! Take it out! Okay! Come on, we're just doing showtime we'll attacks now. Why you care to join us? Get ready! Hey, they both getting fucked here. Yeah. Right? Yes! We got some speed. Get them both! Oh, this is my first time ever seeing her shit. Ooh! Whoa. Holy shit, that was amazing. any time so this is where the monarch of Sapporo resides is this all carved ice it must be really cold the frozen cape that denies all entry does this represent her distrust for all others you are you don't look so good are you all right mm -hmm. I should be then let us proceed as usual skull it's up to you no know why you're volunteering me, but here goes nothing. Come on, Stis. Because you're that guy, pal. 
You did this! It's all your fault! How could you be so ignorant? Did you not think a snow sculpture could collapse? I... I apologize on behalf of our staff. Here it comes! A collapsing snow sculpture. This is where she... It must have been so heavy. It must have been so painful. Get me, Kaho! Give me back my daughter! Oh my god. My precious little girl. The accident resulted from my own personal oversight. Truly, I'm so sorry. Is the mayor the one apologizing? Shh, there's still more. I was like, I don't listen to this. Well, I didn't think the statue had fall on anybody. But isn't this the mayor's Wait. responsibility in the end? Well, besides, who can blame me? Well, we don't get paid nearly enough. Nothing wrong with taking a little kickback here and there. Those voices must be the root of Mariko Hyoda's trauma. So, that snow sculpture incident... Didn't we first hear about it at the park? We did, but I had no idea. Could Mari-san have really been involved? That seems possible. Is that the source of her trauma? Taking the blame for that incident? Don't forget the guy's voice. It sounded like he was trying to pass the blame on someone. At any rate, this is vital information. Let's go back to reality and confirm the truth. That was vital fucking information. So someone died, and do wanted to pass blame on someone else, but she obviously wanted to take responsibility for it. Uh, that, that's, that's fucked up. But that, that is one thing I like about this game, is that the backstories on how we become bad guys. Because in Persona 5 Royal, like, they were supposed the to have stuff incident. like that, but they Let cut it out of the game for some Two odd years reason. Ago, a large snow like, I personally would have loved to have known the backstory by of, of some of the villains in, in Persona 5 Royal. Like, why Kamashina was such a fucking creep? Died, despite why Madarame was so great? The accident was ruled as an unforeseeable disaster. Therefore, she wasn't held liable. Oh, so that's what the flowers in the park were for. I wonder if the voice accusing Mari-san was the poor girl's mother. So this is Mari-san's trauma. That park where the snow festival was held is probably where the accident happened. Then let's head over. Yeah. Let's use Emma and enter the keyboard there. Hmm. The accident happened in Adori Park. Let's then let's get out of the hideout first and head over. There should be a warden guard in the place. At the last few times was in the location. Don't skimp on the prep work, Nova. What the fuck? <clears throat> this is where the accident happened, isn't it? If we put in the keyword here, we should be able to access the trauma cell. There may trauma be enemies cell. ahead. You sure you guys are ready? Yes, nigga, yes. I'm ready. I That's cooked right. us some food. I want to see what happened screen. to Mari san with my own two eyes. The keyword is Snow City. Keyword successfully entered. Beginning navigation. Uh, my head is itchy. So who's else have we gotta be? Hmm?
something. You? Don't you want to do the right thing? As far as I'm concerned, that's whatever's right for me. Fuck this asshole. Well, are you finally ready to listen? Answer me, Mayor. Be ready. Why does he have so many shields? I gotta whoop his ass. How can you blame a peon like me? We don't get paid enough for this. This world revolves around money. Money talks, bullshit walks, Mayor. Faster! Threatened the mayor? Is that it? I had no idea Marisol went through something like this. Something so awful. Think later, act now. We've got a real fight in our hands here. Madonna's right. Die, motherfucker! What's the weakness, boy? Oh, look at the app, all that. Let's get it if you want. Travis! But I'm gonna do it you first. Ooh, let's go! This is the range of damage of all gun attacks. While holding triangle, ammo will no longer be consumed. Nigga. Nah, this is kind of cheap. I'm legit, might just use armor. I can just. I'll give it my own. I can just use damn gun. I'll give it my own. Like I'm no longer consuming ammo. I can legit just sit here. Oh, let's fucking go. Yeah, I'm gonna have food before we get back. And of course, he did nothing.
Enemies are pulled in during the spinning portion of square triangle or with square 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 triangle. Throne room now. Who were those guys? They were arguing with the mayor just now. One was a city employee. The other must have been a councilman. Someone higher up on the ladder. Anyway, it seems this employee accepted an illegal donation from the contractor who ended up building the sculpture. Payment for lending them the job. In other words, bribery. We don't know if the sculpture collapsed due to a structural issue or a general lack of care. The result is still the same. Either way, the councilman was in the know. Not only that, he tried using a fatal accident to take Mayor Hyodo's position. <sighs> Something along those lines. Ugh, unforgivable. Everything makes sense now. Hyodo overheard this conversation by chance and found out the truth about the accident. Not only was it someone from the city, but even her own staff had blackmailed her. That's messed up. These greedy assholes only wanted money and power. Now I have a better understanding of what Hyoda must be thinking. When she found out those around her were immoral, she became determined to purge the corruption above all else. That's why she's overworking her staff and trying to push her ethics bill through. And Makes on top sense. of it, she's trying to manipulate the people into re-electing her. True. Well, no matter what the reason, the birdcage is finally open. Mm -hmm. Let's head back to the hideout and discuss the specifics of the calling card. This is good Morgana is spinning. Even though it wasn't her fault all the way, she takes full responsibility of it. And now is using that to now try to manipulate everybody to vote for her. That's fucking tough. Sucks that, you know, she died and all that stuff. But come on now. There, there was another way so to So what do we this. do for the calling card? Maybe we shouldn't go overboard with it. I don't really see her as a bad person. Yeah, to be honest. Yeah. The real bad guy here is the one who took the bribe. No, the guy who offered the bribe in the first place is the true villain. Was it not the shoddy contractors who built the sculpture? And they deserve the most punishment. <sighs> you guys sound pretty heated. 
Who's to say one man's more evil than the next? What the fuck is he doing, Alvar? First of all, what was he even so doing So you were there? here all along. What's your angle here? Whoa, why the hostility? Because can I remember... About me, didn't I remember why, why I really don't like this guy now. Well, uh, now that you mention it... Gramps, you completely slipped our minds. <gasps> Alright then. Maybe I'll forget to keep you from getting arrested. Okay, uh, we're sorry. Ah, uh, forget it. So what's our situation? Now yeah, I guess our situation. Picture. So that's how Mariko Hyoto became a monarch. Hmm, that would explain your debate as to who was the worst of them all. What's your take on it, Gramps? My take is you kids are naive. Well, what do you mean? What do you mean by that? Mariko Shiota was cornered by a pair of rotten scumbags. Tragic, I agree. But what is she doing in response? Isn't it just as wrong to change people's hearts and manipulate them? That may be true, but... Furthermore, that accident was her responsibility, being that she's the top of command. Regardless of who did what, a real leader takes the fall. But even so... Okay. It He's may spinning. be a bitter pill to swallow, as much especially as I hate to for say, a group of justice-loving kids operating outside the law. But the real world isn't so cut and dry. And the longer you keep up this hero charade, the harder it'll bite you in the ass down the line. Kichi, that's terrible. Take it back. Is that really what you think? Where, where? <sighs> like. Uh, this isn't our first rodeo, and it damn sure won't be our last rodeo. Might have overstepped my boundaries. Okay. No, I can understand your line of reasoning. Like Jesus Christ. You're saying that the world isn't neatly divided into good and evil. But that won't stop us from fighting. If we give up now, then the people who are counting on us won't have any hope left. We help people in a way no one else can. That's why the Phantom Thieves exist. I understand you all take this very seriously. Then tell me. Either way the cards fall. You're not letting Hyoto get away with what she's doing, are you? Correct. We're going to stop her, Haru. What Mari-san is doing is forcing her warped intentions onto other people. And we can't let that happen, no matter what the reason. Right. We're the Phantom Thieves, and we fight for what we believe in. Yes, Hell we'll yeah. stop Hyoto. But we'll do it in a way that's true to us. Let's take back all the desires. I have no objections. It's decided then. Thank you. Thank you, Novaku. So how will we send the calling card? Maybe we could send it over with some curry to the mayor's office? Yeah, all right. Are we a catering service? <sighs> if anything, it should be ramen. Might be better Ryuji. to avoid closed spaces, actually. After all, she'll probably be outside prepping for the election most of the time. Very There's no point true. sending a calling card if the target doesn't see it. I wonder if we can send it somewhere on her campaign route. Like somewhere she's bound to pass by. Then how about where the Suzushino posters are? I'm sure she'll have a speech over there. Good thinking, her. Yeah, I really love yeah. her. And if we time it with oh, her speech, it'll be perfect. Video, the question is, who's going it. to place it there? Let me hear it. Ah, uh, no. Not again. Seriously? Thanks in advance, Gramps. Now hold on just a minute. Didn't I already pull this stunt for you in Sendai? Consider yes, it a and... favor, then. Yeah, for being such a meanie earlier. Exactly. Shouldn't you own up to it? Fucking rude ass. There's no need to worry. We'll make the calling card for you. Exactly. We'll be counting on you, Gramps. <laughs> You're our only hope. Might as well say yes. <sighs> you little weasels. All right, <clears throat> fine. Fine. I'll post the damn calling card. We really do appreciate it. How'd I let them twist my arm like this? Uh, whatever. If we're really doing this, it'll be early in the morning. Don't be late. Don't be late. Hey. Yodo switches tomorrow morning. That's when we make her aware of the calling card. We only have one shot at this. <clears throat> Let's make sure we're prepared before we send Senkichi out. And with that, we're going to end off the episode right here. Okay, I'm not gonna try to make it a long episode. I like, like, with this playthrough, I like doing certain parts. So that's why it kind of like a pattern, okay? 
we go into the jail, we do our investigations, then we get out, then we fight the mini boss, then we send the Colonel Grant to the big boss. Then a whole lot of stuff is in between that I have to cut out or do off screen. Because I don't want to make episodes too freaking long, okay? But as always, guys, hope you enjoy. If you did, leave a like, comment down below what you think of the video, subscribe if you're new, click that notification bell, and do all that good stuff in the description box with my socials down there. Alright? <clears throat> like my Twitch, my TikTok, my Instagram, my Twitter. I'm all over the damn place as far as social media is concerned these days. And it feels good being back on YouTube. And once again, thank you so much for 40 subs on Twitch. It may not be a lot to some, but it's a lot to me. Okay? And thank you once again for helping me hit affiliate on Twitch. That has been one of my big time goals as a content creator. And you guys helped me achieve that very much so. Now, next video probably won't be until next week. Because I plan on streaming on Twitch throughout the weekdays. That's right. If you manage to stay in the video to this point, you will hear my schedule firsthand. So, as far as schedule is concerned, Twitch will be Mondays through Fridays. Time, it varies. But on Saturdays and Sundays will more likely be when I upload YouTube videos. Alright. And that's all I can say for now. Um, if you would like to join other shit like the Discord, you can go to my Twitch and do exclamation point Discord and join the server from there. Because I don't want to have the server link here on my YouTube description. But anyways, enough chatting. I will see you guys next time.